Hey guys, it's Tasha. I'm here today to show you guys what I purchased from an Asian market. I've just discovered Hot Pot, so I wanted to get a few things to try that. And also, Chef Ricotta, um, he had some recipes on his channel about like cleaning your arteries and stuff. And I still haven't gotten everything I needed for that part, but I showed a few things that I got. But let's start with the uh, hot pot stuff first. That, let me look right there. This right here is just some spinach. It's just a bunch of spinach I put in a, a stainless steel cup. And that's going to be part of the hot pot. The, red, the other is the bok choy. And how much was this? I thought this was going to be more expensive. For six of these, I got it was a dollar and ninety-five cent. The ginger here, that is for Chef Ricotta, a little, um, what's it called? A little artery cleaning thing. I got these potatoes. I got six potatoes. It's going to be me, my son, my middle son, and my baby girl. So it's three of us. So. You know, I'm doing it like they're going to get, everybody will get two bok choy, two potatoes sliced. Uh, I don't know if they're going to want any of the mushrooms, but I did get some mushrooms. And if they don't want mushrooms, I'm going to cook this with something else um, when I'm doing my meal prep. And I'll put those with that. This pineapple is for Chef Ricardo's little thing. I got some cabbage. I got this cabbage because my daughter has been making kimchi she saw it on tiktok so i asked her to make some kimchi with the cabbage i'm going to cut it into shreds and use it with the hot pot situation i got garlic because basically i just like garlic and i'm going to put this in with my hot pot as well the lemon is two is for chef ricotta the tahini i'm going to look for i think it's peanut sauce so I might have to go to Kroger to find it. I didn't see it in the Asian market. That doesn't mean it wasn't there. It just means that I was too overwhelmed or just straight out missed it. I forgot who it was. There was another gentleman that I was watching on YouTube who said the basic dipping sauce for the hot pot was, I think it was peanut sauce and tahini or peanut sauce and sesame seed oil I don't know I can't remember I'm gonna have to go back and watch it but I did get some sesame oil I got this what is this this is the Vietnamese beef flavor um, soup base and I got a chicken flavored soup base I picked up the ghee just because because it was like seven bucks and it's pure ghee yeah I wanted that because eventually I am going to start back with my, what is it, with my keto diet. I'm going to do that again. I got this stuff right here, which I should not have because this is not what I was hoping. I wanted the, I think it was the bean noodle, something like that. It wasn't this one. And this one actually is not for hot pot. So I'm going to take this back and get something else. I bought these ginger chews because I just like ginger. That's all that is, and I've been eating those non-stop since I opened them up. I got the Mama, the chicken flavored uh, noodles back here. That you can you see that back there? Just barely, it's right there. So I got those. Uh, that's a whole box, and I got us these things. I got three of these. These are the hot pots, the uh, individual ones. I'm trying to see if I can find a knife so I can open one up real quick and show you guys what it looks like. Let me go over here. Hopefully I didn't touch that. And I got three. Like I said, I got one for me, one for my youngest daughter, and one for my middle son. So he said he was willing to try hot pot with us. Oh, and I got to show you guys the meats as well. I get to, let me get this hot pot because I'm just not opening these. Like I said, I got three of them because I didn't want to do the the one big one. I wanted to do the individual ones. And if these don't work for whatever reason, I can send them back through June the 9th. Okay, so a 
comes with instruction book. Thank you card and your yeah your instruction manual. And this is the the top for the hot pot. And here it is. Come on out of that. Let's wrap it's wrapped nicely with the bubble wrap. And it's cute too. So this is it. Here's the power. This is for if you're steaming eggs. This doesn't come out, but here's the hot pot. And I saw I saw um, somebody else with one of these, and I don't know if it's gonna work like I want it to. I hope it does. I want it to boil. You know, like if I put it on two, I want it to boil and continue to boil. And I can switch it to one and maybe one will be a simmer. So I hope this works out. I hope this is the one that I, that I saw that did work out. So it says electric hot pot. So I hope that means that this is the one that we're going to need. And let me show you the meats that I got right quick. Okay, I um, this is some shrimp. I only got, I I got twelve, so each one of us can get like four shrimp a piece, and they're not huge shrimp. Pull one out, and sorry about the noise, guys. This is what the shrimp look like. They're they're not the head on kind. Just, I guess these would be considered to be fairly large shrimp. Put this in, back in the freezer. And I got this beef eye, beef eye round thin slice. Like I said, I couldn't find the shade, so I got the thin slice. So this is a, a real um, lean one. And I hope it's going to be, what's the word? I hope it's going to be tender enough. I got this one, which is the uh, ribeye thin sliced, and this is another ribeye thin slice. So this one is more lean. This one is more fatty. And I did not find any pork, but what I'm going to do is go and get bacon, and uh, we'll have some bacon um, for our hot pot. So I think that's it. I'm going to go to a dollar store maybe and just pick up a few dishes so I can make it kind of cute you know once I set the table you know because I've seen people put like all the greens in a spot and all the vegetables and then all the meats and stuff like that and have the sauces out and you have your your one plate or your bowl what you eat out of and I'm going to look for small what are those things tongs so, you know, we can dip our stuff out with the tongs onto a plate or a bowl, and then we can finish eating like that. Okay, guys, that's it. I want to thank you so much for taking time out of your day to watch my video. If you haven't, I would greatly appreciate it if you would subscribe to my channel. Also, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. All your comments are truly appreciated. Come back anytime, and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye-bye, guys.